Sarindu Dayaratna, an electrical and electronics engineer of the University of Peradeniya and a research engineer at the Arthur C. Clarke Institute for Modern Technologies, built the Ravana 1 satellite along with Dulani Chamika Vitanage, a mechatronics engineer from the same institution. Ravana 1 is a cube satellite designed and built in Kyushu Institute of Technology in Japan. The satellite is 1000 cubic centimeters in size and weighs 1.1 kilograms. I'm doing the ADCS uh, subsystem in Bird 3 CubeSat. Through this Bird 3 project, I'm learning a lot about the space uh, engineering and even the electronics and the programming. Studying about space engineering was a dream and then actually uh, now I'm studying about that, so I'm very happy about that. I hope that Bird 3 satellite will be successful. So my part in Bird 3 is communication subsystem. It's a very important subsystem and if communication subsystem fails, satellite fails. My uh, final aim is learning something and making the satellite for the country. The satellite was officially released to the Japanese media yesterday. It is expected to fulfill five missions with capturing pictures of Sri Lanka and the surrounding region being among them. Another is active attitude stabilization which ensures that satellite's attitude is stable under influence of external talks. Accordingly, the Ravana 1 will be handed over to the Japan Space Exploration Agency on the 18th and will later be sent to the International Space Station on the 17th of April through the assistance of Cygnus 1 spacecraft from the United States. Ravana 1 is expected to orbit 400 kilometers away from the Earth. The minimum lifespan of Ravana 1 is one and a half years but is believed to be active for up to five years.